Hello everyone and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3, part 13, Burgundy, Money, Staying Alive. And so in the previous episode, we successfully captured a part of Burgundy and Brittany. Now uh, we declared we were going to capture the whole of Brittany before we die, or at least try, since we're very old. And also to keep a lot of money in the bank for when the transfer of power will happen. And so here we are with the Kingdom of France and... <clears throat> there is a war going on here, he's gonna win it for sure. I mean... Unless... Yeah, he's got 2k versus his opponent has only... 1400 so uh, I don't even think we'll need to capture uh, to send our help Duke Razna was sent to prison I wish to kill him and I can actually I can execute him if I want it would be beheaded I wish we could choose and remember in CK2 when you would kill someone, you would hear the noise of that killing. So if it was burnt at the stake, you would hear fire and screaming. If it was beheaded, you would hear the schlock. If it was eaten by a bear, you would hear a bear or, you know, like, etc, etc. I miss, I really miss that from CK2. And I guess they decided it was too gory, so they removed it. But... Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna ask on Steam if they could put it back. I doubt they watch Steam though, but or maybe on their forum. Anyway, um, allowing you to execute him without being viewed as a tyrant. And you know what's sad is the story of Aznar and I, King Louis. We were, I think, we started out as friends even um, when we were young. I remember Aznar did something for me. I can't remember exactly what it is. I mean. I'm 62 years old now. That was 60 years. That was like uh, 50 years ago. Um, but I remember there was a, a little story with us. And then we grew up. We, we've gained titles. And this one became a duke. And he never got a seat on the council. And he got pretty pissed about that. But look, look at his attributes. You cannot give... You cannot give someone low like this any sort of power. So, I guess this is me uh, just saying a little word to Duke Asna. Um, uh, not to him, but uh, about him before we execute the action. I don't want to lose 50 opinion from all of his children. I mean, after all... He does have an heir, and that would be Count Casio. And Count Casio actually likes me. Actually, when I think of that, they, they do not have heirs because I removed his titles. So basically, he doesn't have anything. He does have claims. And Count Casio actually has the county of Mo. And where is that? It's right here. It's right close to me. Um, boy. But yeah, his father is Asnar. So if I kill him, uh, this dude right beside me will hate me. So... You know, he's only got 109 people, but he could create factions or things like that. And why put people against us? Maybe I could torture him? Will people hate me? Yeah, 30. Plus the church. No, I'll just uh, move him to the dungeon. 15 opinion from his family. That's fine. I mean, the guy declared war on me three, four times. Uh... You know, eventually you've just got to. You've just got to take action. Uh, okay, Prince Bishop, where of course we're gonna release him. And we're gonna do so.
we're gonna yeah there you go now this guy likes us um for a favor so i can't ransom anyone for money i guess just one character that's probably him renounce claims Uh, this child, seven-year-old, we're gonna negotiate. We're just gonna release him. Uh, same thing for him. Three years he's been in my prison. Oh boy, since a baby. On house arrest, it's not that bad, but still. Release. And, um... Unimportant character, release. And I don't know what this guy... Already considering a release. All right. Okay. Yeah, we are sending our armies over there. Let's advance time a little. Your condition. There was no condition. As I struggle to make out the tiny letters on the scroll, we've seen this. Uh, there's not a lot of interaction we found out in the game. Uh, we're still early into it. Uh, yeah, so we'll do that. My son, Lotai. So, it's still the oldest one. But now there's a new guy to share with. Oh, good lord. Good lord, I can't believe you made this old fool a son. Well, he's not a fool, so let's... I'm just saying, I just can't believe it. We've... We've... Uh... This is... All of my Louis died, so I am going to make one Louis that, you know, hopefully will live. I don't think my father was Carloman. My father was Carloman. Wait a second. So, King Louis the Stammerer. King Louis. But we don't see it here. Why? Where is... Where is he in the family tree? Prince Carloman of France, your father. I don't get it. Louis Carloman. Oh, yeah, I remember. I remember. Okay. This guy died in battle. Oh, yeah, that was the... Uh, the Prince Warrior. Oh, I remember him. Uh, he fought our wars from the age of 17 to 36. Until eventually he died from his wounds. Uh, what a true hero this guy was. And then we wanted the throne to go to Prince Béranger. But it actually it went to Prince Carloman. And... Uh, and Prince Kellerman had King Louis III. So that's what happened. I had a lot of Louis. Let's let's name after my father, Carloman. There you go. In good memory. Let's assault that fort. Let's get it done with. 51 stress. No, no. Eventually something will come up. I seize Quindle's sword at the Siege of Dunkeld. Nice. Plus 6. We're gonna go attack these guys as well that are attacking the um, capital of my enemy. There is a strait here, so how about we change commander? Oh, we don't have any that can cross seas without penalties. Hmm. 
We used to have some. Ah, Forder. There you go. And it's the best one too. So, there you go. Defending in hills, defensive, building, building. How am I defending? I'm actually attacking. Anyway, more commander tray, more soldiers, more men at arms. And but this guy is of higher quality. Mm, I don't think so. I guess so. All right, let's just go for it. Oh my god. Again for the kingdom of Jerusalem. Ah, there you go. See, and I didn't have to take any stress. And now we're friends. This can wait. Beneficiary. Alright, I think I've done my part here, right? Let's capture this capital and then let's go regroup at... Uh... <laughs> uh, nice one, queen. Hawis. I'm not giving you shit. And yeah, that's what I wanted to do. It's go take a look at the artifact. Inventory. Learn language manual, a collection of notes and scribble. Learn language, keep power plus four. I don't really care for that, but uh, we will repair it. Crawling Saga, good for 91 year. 633, oh, that's gonna cost a lot to repair eventually. Already 63 gold, and it's just that little thing there. Damn. Okay, so I have a Basque battle axe, prowess two. Or prowess tree. Of course we're gonna go with tree. There you go. Now I've got the weapon. Quintus sword. A wrought iron sword of fine craftsmanship. Everything in this construction serves a purpose. And its lack of opulent pretense gives the owner a strict utilitarian aura. The battle, the Basque battle axe. A battle axe of fine craftsmanship. The wrought iron head is mounted on a sturdy ash aft. It is expertly balanced and as easy to swing as it is sharp. This is going to happen in 11 months. Uh, and of course they have much more people than we do. The walls are breached so we are Attacking there. There you go. Disband all. Enemy, we're, we'll put a Chancellor here. Ooh, Duchess. Hello. 20, that is pretty good. Domestic Affairs. We'll appoint someone, even though we don't really care, because we know we're not going to win. Unfroy Carling, who are you? Nicholas Carling, who were you? Prince Julien, my uncle. Oh. Died in captivity. His parents was King Louis de Stammer. And now I just realized who Geoffroy is in the line. Son of Prince Julien. Who is in turn son of King Louis. And Nicholas Carling is a brother of Geoffroy. There you go. There's a Suffragan Bishop that of our family, Nicholas Carling, Anfoy Carling. These guys deserve something. 
Um, alright, there you go. Unfroy Carling. And who are you, my dear? Where are you? Oh, you're over there. I was gonna give you some lands. It's, uh... There's a Kurti of the Carling Dynasty living over here. Oh, all right. Um, okay. Modify contract. Ah, oh, that is good. Reduce chance of illness. Reduce chance for Kurti contact illness. Carefree stress gain minus 20. You can take the Ember Celibacy. Uh, we got zero stress right now. So we will take Wash Your Hands. Twelve, twenty-two, fourteen, seventeen. Duke Simon, the newly appointed Duke of Burgundy. Fifteen. Unfortunately, she's got twenty, so you guys are not gonna get anything. Emperor Lambert. Oh my God. The Emperor of the Byzantine is. My very own grandson. Wow. I cannot believe that. Will this eventually give us a claim on the Byzantine Empire? Wow, I can't believe we made it. How did that happen? The bully had his son, Prince Nicodemus. He's married with our daughter. They made children. He died right away in 928. And since 928, I guess our... Grandson is on the throne. Can I not see his dynasty or something like that? I guess I'll have to look through... Uh, uh, it's his own dynasty. Aus Abalantes. Irritate, irritate not the ox. If we go into our own family tree, do we see this thing? Oh, I think uh, we've just heard the, the crusade. The Crusade for Jews and let's just press pause for a second. Okay, so we gotta go check in my daughter. That's me. Not her. Ah, there she is. Ermegarde. Wow. Emperor of the Byzantine Empire in my family tree. This guy's still the dynasty head and he's gonna make this decision now. <laughs> ah well. Whatever, right? 
Mercenary higher cost, minus 10%, that's good. Knight plus 1 as well. Vassal limit plus 10, that's good. Short range duration, minus 20, that's good. Vassals are less likely to join Claimant Faction and Liberty Faction, that's very good. General Opition plus 10, that's pretty good. Um, but then if we can, we'll go into the Kin. Forty-seven thousand, forty-five. We're definitely in need of more people, but let's raise the armies. Um, I am gonna tell my next king to go into war. Now, there's two reasons why I do that. First of all, because I want Manasses to have. There you go. I want him to have the Crusader trait. And the second reason is I do have... Well, first of all, he has sons. And then I have a new son as well that could take the crown. So we're good. We're good. Even if even if Manasseh died, we're going to be good. Comely, Fecan, and Pretty, and so Five thousand seven hundred. Jeffrey Carling's favorite hook on you as at CD. They don't even use it. All right. Um, I guess we're gonna go here first. I think this is where there will be less people. So we. Uh, by going there, we'll stop, we'll swing by, we'll say hello to our grandson, bring some gift, you know, and, um... Oh! Shh. He died. Sucks. There you go, Gisha Carling. Where is he right now? He's right over here. Kind word. My pa happened to have crossed with Countess Alina. To my surprise, it seemed as though she does not have a great impression of my friend Edouard. Okay. Perhaps I should take this opportunity to change her mind. Let me tell you a story about Edouard, young child. My wife, Queen Derdre, is with child, and I should be overjoyed. However, she has been acting strange, and I cannot shake the feeling that something is wrong. I would not put it past her to bear someone else's child simply to torture me. Oh, she is 21 and you are 64. I mean, can she just <laughs> go see someone else? Um, let's look into that. I tried to paint Edouard in the best possible light and Countess gradually started listening to with greater and greater interest. When she muttered, I never knew that. To herself, I knew I had made an impression. Good. It seems that my fears may have been unfounded. Despite every effort on the part of my spies, I found no indication that Queen Derry has been unfaithful. Unfortunately, she has found out about my suspicion and is very disappointed in me. Ah, fuck, I'd be pissed if I was her. Man. <coughs> I am a great man, though. Christ, I've been the king since... With King Louis, I think we were... Not a baby, but we were a child when we started out, I believe. Alright, here we go for the crusade. 
after learning that Emperor Lambert would be attending the dance in the castle town of Aintab, I decided that it would be the perfect occasion to pass by. <laughs> pass by. Jesus Christ, that is a long way to go for the dance. Is that dance happening like seven months from now? That's how long it would take to go there. Anyway, we are friends and that's all that matters. Who has lover's box? This dude? Ah, It's okay though. Whatever. My granddaughter is gonna go... Or maybe I could put someone closer to me. No, I've only got granddaughters. My niece, my niece. Uh, she is pretty. She's chaste, impatient, honest. The problem here is she's chased. So fertility minus 25. I don't I want him to keep producing children. So maybe my grand my granddaughter and Vassal, but then yeah. They are related and there's a risk of children being inbred. Oh shit, I didn't know we were on uh uh, oh, well, when my goaler brought the joyous news, I could scarce believe it. My rival, Ansnaw, has finally perished in my dungeon. To think that I will live in a world free from that knave, and to think that I am was the one who brought it about. I'm so happy I could dance. Nice. Okay, um, let's find another one. Well, chance of children, high. All right, let, let's do that. Let's, let's try for that. 500, 600. Let's keep it in the family. Where's our ship? Oh, we're here. With other people. There's obviously a lot of people going into the Infidels land. Alliance form. Gladly accept the marriage proposal. There you go, Emperor. Ah, my grandson. I'm so proud of you. What else can I do good to you? Nah, there's a limit. Plus, we are down in income. My son! You got no one for him? Alright, whatever. And here we are in Byzantine. Seen by all the islands here. Our grandson is just over there. We're getting close. My dear grandfather, I will call on your allowance. Yes, I accept. And you know what? I'm actually I'm 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 right beside my grandson. Don't you fret. I will join your war. 11 22,000 Holy shit. Oh no. Again another war. Oh no, your kingdom is going to shit. Ag again, another war. Definitely nothing is going good here. Bleeding out. Drifting apart. Bleeding out, okay. Shoot it.
Called by all babies cry, but with little. Oh uh, well. The further I delve into my studies, the more apparent the link between mind and body becomes. Too much worry can make you sick, and the mind is no stronger than its vessel. My wise friend Emperor Lambert journals about his worries and swears it ease his mind. I have also read about the benefit of vigorous movement to soup freight nerves. Learning, stress loss. I would rather get athletic. Yes. I think the Byzantine Empire is going to shit. Unfortunately. This guy wants the title. And it's really unfortunate. There's a lot of people there. It doesn't look like the Byzantine Empire actually has a lot going for him in terms of... Duke Clamber doesn't have a lot of... Uh, power here. Only 2k. Hmm. That is unfortunate, I would say. Let's keep raiding over there. Won the war, the, we won the war led by brother or the against Tatul. Okay, you promise? Yes, I will send my troops. Oh God! I need to help my grandson, man. That's. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to step foot at least um, in here. Before we lose the uh, the crusade, kill my niece. Ah, oh. but she's pretty and fecund. Let's just send her away. Can I actually call my allies in the, in the war against my grandson? I cannot. Okay. Well, it'll have to be. We're losing a lot of people here. You became finally... This guy died. King Adam of Bavaria. Queen Beatrice of Alba. Oh boy. East Rakia has been separated. Okay. Beatrice is now the Queen of Alba. That's fine. Who's got East Rakia now? King Ludberg. Now... King Adam of Bavaria has this. How does King Lutberg get East Frankia? Oh, I see, I see. King Adam of Bavaria. He had the throne originally, I guess, and he died. So now Lutberg, his son, got East Frankia. This guy got Bavaria. Okay. Okay, here we are.
There you go. I participated in your useless war. Your war contribution. Siege. Okay. 100%. Wow. Let's actually go here as well. Oh! Yeah, why not? Finally, a new perk. Disease. Massive boost. There you go. Let's live. King Luberg replace you. Why? Ah, I hate that. Alright, I've done enough here. Let's go back helping our grandson. And we're gonna start by going here. Who posed the biggest threat? This dude. This dude is 10,000 strong. He's over here right now. King Ledbird doesn't have a lot of armies. And, uh... Wait. They all look the same. Duke Irinaos and Duke Teotoros. Same armors, different faces. Too strong, too strong. I'm first already, so people are not fighting it, it looked like. They're doing sweet fuck all. We're supposed to have 30,000 people. Where are they? 24,000 now. I have no idea where they are. we lost oh boy after this war we're gonna call it a day I feel like uh, we're, he's gonna lose the kingdom for sure no longer malnourished. Nice. That is awesome. Um, yeah. No, I don't care about you. I have no such issues. <laughs> White piece. Ah, oh, that is great news. Now, the only problem is this guy. But this guy only wants the county of issues. Is that really a problem? We're still, uh, we could still fight. Let's go here. Whatever. We've seen this thing so many times now. Um, Spy Master, we're missing out on. All right, Robert Carling, come do your duty. Collect taxes. I don't care. Oh shit, was that my wife? <laughs> no! The only time I don't really read. What is going on, Queen Deidre? Uh, all right, whatever. Let's 
There are 8,000 here. I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything against that. Let's... Um, What's this title? There, 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 there. Whose title is this? Okay. Nine allies to his name. All right. Oh boy. I just don't know where to go anymore. Um, all right, let's go here. Nice. Locked in a room, strange powders. How much time has passed before a strange <coughs> vision of light and pulsing sound came to me? What is my imagination? A glimpse of the divine? Is there any way? I need to try again to see if anything is different. Interesting. I'll recruit my. Yeah, let's, let's check it out. As I spread more and more, I get clearer and clearer grasp on things. It is as if I can now summon the presence uh, I feel when I start my little ritual. It offers stability and comfort as the chaos of the world swirls around me. Wise man, hardly anything divine, but very relaxing. Yeah, wise man. Thank you. It is clear to everyone that it is who governs it. Its many hills and villages are overseen to by my bailiff and my magistrate. Therefore, I am laying claim to it. You are welcome to grant the title to me whenever you wish, else I am sure that it will fall to me in due times. I have let Illity grow too strong. That would be tyranny, yeah. Um, she doesn't like me anymore. Ah, eh, whatever. Ah, oh, she's been murdered. <sighs> Man, at 26. Not one day too soon. What? Wow, that is harsh. Defeat. Okay, well now I, I guess we could concentrate on this dude only, so that's always good. There you go, let's go here now. Still just... Hmm. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do, actually, is, um... What? Why? Okay, anyway. Um... 
yeah, this guy doesn't need to fight anymore in our armies. He doesn't have the Crusader trait somehow. But, you know, at least he participated in wars in Byzantine, in uh, Jerusalem. You know, he did get some... You know, he's not uh, he's not a king who's never seen battle, but he hasn't seen a lot. Uh, okay. We're going to stretch this episode just for this war. Look at these dudes. Again. Oh, good lord. Here's an occasion to kill someone without the others. He's probably gonna f flee though. Nope. There you go. That is nice battle. Let's try to get back at him now that he's separated from the others. Uh oh, Burgundy. Oh boy. Sorry, grandson, but I need to go care for my kingdom. And now the voyage home. Yeah, actually I forgot to take Burgundy this whole time, but we were so busy in that war of his, um, we completely forgot about it. Anyway, I tried to help him as best I could and, you know, eventually it's the most important war we couldn't help him with in, in the end. We could try that. Uh, being allied with the Byzantine kingdom is really... Oh boy, it's a pain. Raise the levies. I'm going to side with the church here just because. Okay, we're 5,000. Let's go here and directly to their castle. And uh, these guys are going to have to capture a lot of things before. Oh god, dude! I I gotta I gotta stop eventually. I lose fame if I do so. Oh goddamn! I gotta break my 
truce with the Byzantine. 5% chance. More time. Okay, one captured. On our war led by Emperor Lambert of the Byzantine Empire, led by Lupu. Oh, that's not him. Ended inconclusively. He died. Vanished without a trace. That's the peasant rebel. Wow. She plus 100. I don't know why she would want to kill me. We'll accept her gift. Ah! Oh! Okay, I thought I thought it was me and that was the girl that killed my wife. Okay, the time has come. My agents are in place. One of them will pay the assassin uh, the very night the deed will happen. Another will enter the wall is unguarded. A third will leave a subtle trail of candles to Duke Theodos' bedchamber. Everything is in place. 5%. I guess we gotta try it eventually. Escape unharmed. Yes, made it inside the castle, but did not reach the Otoros chambers. When he was uh, spotted and the alarm was raised, yes, immediately made his escape and has not been heard from since. He's on his guard. Let's try again. There you go. It's pretty much impossible for Burgundy to... Oh, it's for the artifact. Oh. Wow. It was not what Lope was hoping to find by spying on secret conversations, but discovering the truth about Luistina does not hurt. Okay. Let's check what my children's are. Okay. Robert, Manassas, Louis. This guy is nine years old already. We we didn't even see his life going. Education focus. Yeah, diplomacy is the good choice here. White piece. Oh, nice. Nice. I'm glad. I'm glad for him. Wow, he's, you can be addicted to Ashish in this game. Okay. I'm still gonna try to kill him because he looks like a, he, he is very powerful. Alright, let's finish this war. And, and then we'll end this uh, episode with Burgundy. Forty-eight percent. Let's try. My attempt has been thwarted. Damn! If at first you don't succeed, keep doing. There you go. And force my demand. She'll pay money. She'll spend this. All right. Ah, oh, finally, this band all. Yes. Paid out of her whole treasury to aid for my effort. Wow, thank you.
Okay, guys. Wow, what a what an episode. It was uh, an eventful one. We've lost another crusade, first of all, and we successfully successfully aided. Ah, oh, god damn it! This she's got a claim on the Byzantine Empire. Everyone wants to be against him. Oh god. We're, I think we're gonna have to help them out. Before we leave, just let's check this out real quick. You can create the Duchy of Aragon, and we will. There you go, that's this one around here. And we're gonna grant it to. Dukes? No, he's already uh, a duke. Is there a Carling somewhere that doesn't have any power? Oh boy. him he's got children's he's young he's got a wife still young let's check him as well yeah this guy's got a big family and he's already in the land so there you go grant title the duchy of Aragon it is yours yours to fight for now enjoy your new title my friend Okay. Really, my old friend. And why should I... She's a fornicator. Let's just revoke our title, I guess. Yeah, we'll wait, we'll wait. All right, guys, this is it. Um, Current situation, Bavaria, East Francia, same family. This is all the Carling family. They've separated. Lotharingia, still very peaceful, just minding their own business as always. Um, not doing much. Lost a big chunk here. But uh, still. Burgundy separated. We've captured a little bit of ground. We did nothing again with Brittany, but let's not forget about it. We'll do something right about now. Uh, next, we want Nout. Uh, Akiten is still just uh, doing their own stuff. They're nice. They're nice people. Italy is held by... I don't know who that is, actually. By the Carling family. Alright. So, Italy is still good. Byzantine Empire is actually... It's taking back a lot of grounds around here in uh, Italy. It would make sense for them to want to do that. They're probably... Their most danger is Bulgaria and obviously inside of their own realm. Which right now, they're losing the war and we're going to try to come and help them. Because I don't want my grandson losing Byzantine. Hold on tight. Lambert, we're coming in the next episode. Thank you. Oh, and we successfully actually, yeah, the only successful thing we did is um, 
we've we've gained money. We've secured a bank for our next emperor uh, king, and that's always a good thing. We're 974. So after we die, we will arrive in the thousand, and that's gonna be an exciting time to to be in. Thank you everyone for watching, and I'll see you next episode. Goodbye.